What's up, y'all? Sparta here. Um, this isn't going to be a super long video. It's just going to be um, <laughs> me talking about something. Again, that LG is kind of skimping on in marketing and not really telling anybody when it comes to like reviewers and stuff like that. Not necessarily me because I paid for this phone, but other reviewers that are pretty much getting the phones for free and are not giving them truly all the information that they necessarily need to review this phone. Now, what I'm talking about is that so apparently the LG G7 supports quick charge 4.0. But it comes with a quick charge 3.0 charger in the box. So this is very similar to what um, HTC did with the HTC One M9, I think it was, where it supported quick charge 2.0 or whatever the quick charge standard was at the time. But it came with a regular ass brick in the box. At least LG puts a quick charge 3.0 charger in the box. But for some reason, they decided, oh... We know we have this phone that supports Quick Charge 4.0. No other of the major phones support it at the moment. I'm sorry, I, I'm using the Note 8. And I my tripod's kind of messed up right now, but so why don't why do we why don't we just sit there and um not put a quick charge 4.0 charger in the box? Now, this is coming from me just watching a video. I'll show you guys the channel here real quick. Oh shit, sorry. The channel's called uh Tech Time and and his video is titled Um LG G7 Qu Quick Charge 4.0 and sorry the note 8 isn't focusing. A feature nobody is talking that a feature no one is talking about. And basically what he did is he bought he either already had the Razer phone charger or he had bought the Razer phone charger, which the Razer phone supports Quick Charge 4 Plus. You know that by the marketing. If you paid attention to the Razer phone, they basically said, oh, this is the first phone to support Quick Charge 4 Plus. No other phone really supports Quick Charge 4.0 right now. I'll bring up the list to show you guys here real quick. And another goddamn thing the V30 does as well. What the shit, man? So let me let me bring it up here real quick for you guys. I don't know why I put the damn phone down. Sorry about that. But and I gotta hold this up here real quick. But let me go back. So on Qualcomm site, I'm on the V30 page right now, and as you guys can not see because the note eight's not focusing. I would use my V20, but it's uploading a video and charging right now. But I'm on Qualcomm site, LG V30. So I scroll down, right? I scroll down. Oh, I got to go to learn more <laughs> because I got out of that section. I go to learn more. I go down to charging. Qualcomm, Quick Charge 4 technology. And this isn't any other phone. It's the LG V30, right? So the LG V30 also supports Quick, supports quick Charge 4.0, right? That's crazy to me that LG is basically just not saying anything about these phones supporting Quick Charge 4. I go to the G7. Not buy now because I got the phone. I go to learn more. It honestly, has a Snapdragon 845. Adreno 630 GPU. I don't care about all that crap. Um, scroll down. Scroll down all the way to charging. Qualcomm Quick Charge 4. So, LG, let me ask you a quick question here. A bit of a heart to heart. <laughs> Why is it that despite the fact that both of your flagship phones are at this moment, whether it be the LG V30, the LG V30s, the S Plus, the V35, it doesn't matter. All LG V, the LG V30 product line basically, and the LG G7. Why is it that 
both of these phones support quick support quick charge for and you're not talking about it but let, hold on let me check if any of the samsung phones do here real quick i'm gonna check here real quick all right so they are on the supported devices the samsung devices but i think they still only ship with the um adaptive fast charging in the box is just quick charge too that samsung's proprietary thing so what i'm gonna do is um i can't necessarily talk about it now because i don't have a quick charge for charging adapter but what i will do is i will buy one <laughs> and obviously i won't have the note 8 when i do get one unless i get like two day shipping and stuff like that i'll test it out and I'll let you guys know how it is, but my main reason for making this video is that I just don't understand why LG isn't saying that it supports Quick Charge 4.0. Because literally every phone review that I've watched of the G7 before I came out and of the V30 <laughs> was every single thing just said Quick Charge 3.0. No review said, oh, it supports Quick Charge 4. None of them do. <laughs> Until I came across that video from Tech Time. Again, look at that channel. I mean, that's the first video I ever watched, but that's some information I just came across. So look at that channel. I'll put a link down in the description. I'll just help him out, I guess, even though he has more subscribers than me, I guess. But that's that's some information that is very vital if you have a G7 or if you have a V30 or if you have a V30 or any of the V30 variants. If you have any of them, <laughs> it's, a, it's very vital information to have that. So I just want to give you guys that. But that's all I really want to talk about. I don't want to make a super long video. This is Sparta. Thank you guys for watching. Thanks for the support. Hope you guys have a wonderful Saturday, whatever time or day it is in your area. Have a good one. I'm trying to make sure it doesn't want to stay. Okay. If you like this video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. Leave a comment down below to let me know what you guys think about this situation here. Again, I think it's dumb, but, you know, it's whatever. Um, share this video with anyone that's interested. Um, if you're new to the channel, subscribe. Hit the notification icon below to know whenever I upload a new video. The next video I will be doing is LGB30 versus G7, so keep that in mind here. Again, have a good one.